have you ever heard of this amazing website right right here right right there it's called repel dot it it's amazing right I but there's no game window there's no game window that's the problem if you want to make games but think no more because now I've made an amazing program that's 100% definitely not bad now you have right here as you can see right here I hope uh, this is the program here uh, so basically how it works you import stuff like so what's this stuff? What are you importing? I am importing replit, time, and random. It starts here if you, you define the horses. This horse game, yeah. Here, let's just Let's show start the at program. the beginning. It's a horse race. Yes. So. so, let's start right here. We, um... Pick a horse. So yeah. we pick a horse, just like if we're at the track. We pick a horse that we think is going to win. We don't bet any money because we're not gambling here. This is not a gambling site. But not a gambling a, site. All right, pick, <laughs> pick a horse. Wait, what horse do you want? Ha, I can't hear you. They want number three. Sure, yeah, number three. There you go. And you can see here. Wow, look at that. And you can see here that it's, um, yeah. So the graphics is continually refreshing and it looks like a horse race in graphics, but it's actually text. Also, you lose, though. So. In your face. Uh, so, so if it was a gambling site, you'd lose money. Yeah. So we saved you some money. Yeah, great job. Uh, Just explain how you made this work. I generated a random number here. I added it to the um, to the score that you have that the horse has, and uh, so that so the farther your score, the more points you have. Well, the farther that you are, it goes all the way up until eighty nine. So that's how the function works. Um, down here, this is how you make it actually go across the screen. You have a tab here in, in front of all the lines, and um, and you expand the tab. You expand the tab. Um, the more the score is, so it makes it seem like the higher the score, the farther the farther it is along. So this graphic here, uh, just to show you an example. This here, every single line is a separate is uh, is a separate tab, separate new line. Yeah, so it moves across the screen. Um, but here, it expands the tab H H one. Very basically, what this is here. Very basically. Very basically, the scoring system up here it tallies up your score it uh, with your variable here. So. Um, every, so it loops every single time, up here, uh, all the way until it reaches the end. How do you know it's the end? How do you know it gets to the end? It gets to the end uh, when one of them reaches 89. Um, Why it, 89? Why did you pick that number? Because that's, that's uh, how far it reaches. Like You, um, you would print an, an, an end of race, and if the horse, horse int, the variable they chose at the beginning, um, was that number, then it prints you win. Else, prints you lose. Very basically. So, are you going to share this with your friends? Are they going, these people going to be able to log in and see your uh, awesome game? No. But you can copy it and. They can log into your account, they have to copy it and put it into their own version of Rebel. Yes, I really hope they put the, put the code somewhere in the description. I don't know. Right. I don't know how you do and they that. they can play with it and they can use tortoises instead of horses or whatever they want. Well, I mean, if you find a graphic. Yeah. But, yes, that's, okay. yeah. All right, folks, that's it. Fantastic horse racing game. Get you into the spirit. Um, and uh, that's it. Well done, Matthew. And, um, you know, where this game will be available uh, on uh, GitHub um, or on my blog. At uh, Python for Adults and Kids dot com, and uh, you can get it and play with it, and, and encourage you to <clears throat> to make it your own rather than just running the. Existence. One more thing, though, we need to make this. We need, we need to make this hard for you here, right here. Repel. Oh wait, no, it's over there. Well, wait. Sorry, it's over there. All right, to our vast audience. Yes. Bye. See you soon. Definitely so vast. <laughs>